Mac OS Sequoia just released to all Mac users today. And basically everyone who is thinking about upgrading should definitely watch this video if they're thinking about using Mac OS Sequoia for music production. Comment down below what you think I should give away. And if you do comment, you get the chance to win that giveaway and go ahead and like and subscribe if you want more content like this. What's Papa Gang? I'm 30 Killer Beats, and today I have Mac OS Sequoia on my computer, and basically it's just released to everyone now. I've been using the beta version as well. However, things have not been super great for me when using Mac OS Sequoia uh, for music production. Like certain programs wouldn't open up and certain things like that, and I related that in my first video of this program. Also, I had a few questions in my last video that I didn't get to answer in my main video, was that, you know, if there's certain plugins like Waves or anything like that. However, I was able to fix all of my issues that I had in that particular video with doing one major thing. Basically, you wanna make sure you reinstall Universal Audio's console program or your drivers. After doing that, I was basically able to open up every single program, everything started working, all my plugins from other brands. I don't know how that messed it up, I don't know. So basically, after I got that squared away, I haven't had any issues with any program opening up in Sequoia as far as music production, making beats, or even just recording vocals. Honestly, it's been a great experience so far. And yes, there will be people who tell you, don't do this, don't do that, you know what I'm saying? And I always say this in all my videos when I make these type of videos, you gotta try it out for yourself because you really don't know no, or you can just watch my videos. So basically what I'm about to do is just go through different programs showing you that this program, Mac OS Sequoia, actually works for music production. And real quick, just to show you that I am on Mac OS Sequoia right now, you can see here it is right here, right here Mac OS Sequoia Beta 15.1. So this is even the newest version that, this version is not even out yet. So I'm still on beta right now. But even if I were to go to the, the Mac OS, the regular Mac OS Sequoia, the first version 15.0, it's still gonna work fine. So just to let you know, you can still use this. But as you can see right now, I do have Pro Tools open up already. You know what I'm saying? Just by the start of this. So let's just go ahead and open up a session and let's just see how that loads up. All right gang so i got pro tools opened up and i have a session pulled up right now this song is by me called dog link in the description if you want to listen to that it's on every platform however everything is pretty much working in pro tools and i'm just going to play it just for a little bit cracking up enough to see i ain't got no chill i got my pistol on the field ready for a drill Cause you know what's the deal do the shit for real heading in the hills about to have a Okay, so look, you see basically everything is working. Uh, I got my auto-tune here from Universal Audio, Ataris plugin. All right, so let's try out some Wave plugins. Here go a Wave plugin right here that I use, Silk Vocal. Yeah, as you can see, it's working just fine on my vocals. Um, here's another one from Air. Basically, the full session is working. I, I, if you want me to go through plugins, I mean, Pretty much everything is all working. However, when I'm using my industry quality Pro Tools template um, that you could download in the description for, for free, there's a free version and a paid version. This was able to work just fine in Mac OS Sequoia and all my plugins are working just fine. As you can see, I have, you know, Universal Audio plugins right here. I, you know, I just showed you Wave plugins. Uh, here's some free plugins that are also working as well. It, it's really up to you if you want to download, I mean, at your own risk. This just came out at the recording of this video. But let's try out FL Studio. Let's see how FL Studios is doing. You know, if you wanna make some beats or something like that, let's go ahead and try that out. All right, gang, so I got a beat pulled up in FL Studio that I made, and right now, it, it is a, a collaboration that I did with one of you guys. So here's a beat that I did in FL Studio, and I have everything pulled up, and the session that I'm using is from the Gold Sauce template that you could download as well in the description. This basically helps me make beats that hit way harder and so much faster. And uh, let's just hear this beat play out in FL Studio.
All right, as you can see, that pretty much works just fine. Let's just open up some VSTs, because in this session, I didn't actually use a lot of VSTs. Uh, but, you know, we could open up some right now. We got contact. All right, so as you can see, contact opens up. And uh, everything looks like it's pretty much working. Let's just open one of these up. All right, as you can see, look, Omnisphere is working just fine as well. We could just go through a couple of sounds. All right, we got Massive X. How many of you guys like Massive X? That looks like it's pretty much working. Let me know some other VSTs that you want me to try out on Mac OS Sequoia, and I'll go ahead and try that out. All right, so let's try out Silent One. How many of you guys like to use Silent One? So far, macOS Sequoia has been really great for my music production workflow. And also, let me know in the comments if you have already upgraded to macOS Sequoia and let me know how your experience has been going so far. I'll only use like two DAWs, Pro Tools, and FL Studio. Sometimes I might occasionally use Luna because I just think it's so pretty. Like you just got to go back to Luna and just record a few things here and there just to see if things are working. And it usually does. But also let me know what other videos you want to see on this channel. Make sure you add me on Instagram, TikTok, and X. Y'all have a great day. Peace.